wasn't the best place to overtake a cyclist now, was it? It was a bit tight. Great indication from the golf there. Oh, well, look at this, another idiot parking in the motorbike bay. Yeah. <laughs> well, we all know what that's all about getting bored of that. Where is all the traffic? Moron. Fuck off, crow. What an asshole. You must have saw me coming. Do you see that? He just pulled right out. He apologised, he put his hand up. He, she, whoever it may be. What are you doing? Indication would have helped a little bit. You can't turn right there. <laughs> Whoa, fing hell, everyone's out to get me today. I hope the camera got that. <sighs> right. <clears throat> That's the first time I've had to pull over after a near miss to calm down because I really thought that that car didn't see me at all and was just going to come straight through. Oh. I've had similar near misses like that before, but not quite as close as that. And all sorts of things have happened that have, you know, drivers have aggravated me one way or another for their stupidity. And most of the time I could just get on with it, but that time I just had to stop. Pretty much I brought the bike to... Well, I had to do an emergency stop. I did an emergency stop. 
stalled the engine. I could have carried on, but now I thought, no, I'd better wheel it to one side and take a moment, have a breath. Because situations like that, you only go on and do something worse. Best thing to do, if it's quite a bad one and you, it really works you up, take a breather. On that note, ride safe everyone, see you next time.